Hi guys, I'm Tita Sita from Laundry Basket Quilts. Welcome to Quilting Window Life. It's Friday and I am so excited that you are here. Guess what? Today we have an amazing show ready for you because we have our brand new book, Rainbow Scraps, ready, set, go to ship to you. And I wanted to show you a trunk show with beautiful quilts from the book. And we have some amazing questions for you. And some of you get to win the book. So stay tuned and watch the show. I'm, go I'm going to be talking about the quilts, telling you how, what the size is, how many baskets I have in the quilt. Pay attention because later on I'm going to ask 12 questions at 12 uh, beautiful quilters get to win a book. So stay tuned and enjoy it. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the show. I am so excited for you guys today. I have so many beautiful things and I don't only have things from the book for you today. I have two new things that are just arrived to our studio and I could not wait to share them with you. One of the brand, brand new things that we have is our retreat quilts. Next week on, uh, on the weekend, we starting our retreat. We have 100 ladies coming in and enjoying quilting with me it's going to be amazing i am so thrilled and the girls are going to be working on a beautiful quilts we have a scrappy star uh, that they're gonna be working on it or they can choose and work on a blue star blue star is one of our brand new patterns that just came out with our coco blue collection and as soon as i saw this quilt and i did my patterns i was like oh my gosh guys you're gonna love this as a pre-cut kit and our retreaters are going to be the first 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 ever to be sewing on this beautiful quilt but if you would like to have the kit you can go ahead to our website and put your order in it's going to be shipping not next week the week after but you can secure a kit if you would like to we make few extras so look at this when you open the box you have beautiful packages in every package everything is pre-cut for you those are 60 degree triangles so super easy Easy to work with it because each side is exact the same oh I just finished my quilt and I can't wait to show it to you guys I'm gonna put this kit to the side like I said if you wanted to you can go to our website order the pattern order the kit and it's gonna be shipped to you shortly so that's a new one I like to do something super special for our retreaters, a total surprise. And this year, what we did is a scrappy star. And the scrappy star is just beautiful, has a lot of colors from our uh, Practical Magic collection and our beautiful, beautiful Primrose collection. Again, it comes in a beautiful box like this. When you open the box, everything is pre-cut, ready, set, go for you guys just to jump right into it and enjoy, enjoy. And guess what? Oh, I just bumped something. I have the quilt also finished. So I'm gonna show it to you shortly. And we have a few extra from the retreat. So you, if you want it, you can grab a kit. Again, they're not going to be shipped until uh, next week, N not next week, the week after. So uh, make sure you pay attention to that. Our retreaters, all the kids are secure. They're waiting for you guys. If there's any retreaters that are watching the show, girls, I cannot wait to have you in. Guess what? Today, our staff is busy, 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 like low bees, packing your door prizes. And do we have awesome surprises for you? Just come to the retreat you get to find out no nope, i'm not allowed to tell you no nope, don't hold me no nope, i can't do it there's so many awesome things so come uh enjoy the retreat and we have so many nice things for you and can't wait to see you quilt with you visit with you eat with you laugh with you cry with you and just enjoy each other's company i'm so looking forward to it but I promise to show you the quilt. So for anyone that is not coming to the retreat, the girls going to be working on this beautiful, beautiful quilt. This one is the uh, Coco 
uh, the blue star it's in cocoa blue fabric look how stunning it is i just finished the quilt off i'm gonna be quilting it and having it ready for my girls when they come in i already finished the first one the scrappy one binding is on it it is so beautiful so i want to show you that one this is the scrappy star look at this isn't it beautiful just incredible and like i said we only have few extra kits we, we were able to make so if you want a kid go to our website grab it and we're going to make those available for you our retreaters were the first one to choose so that way they have it when they come here and quilt with me but we did make few extras so you can get one too but now let's get into what i have it on the table for you guys we're gonna talk about our brand new book called Col uh, rainbow scraps color wheel quilts isn't that stunning look at the pages the photography is just beautiful it's done by Erin and Mary that work in our office they are so talented we have traveled to a beautiful place in uh, uh, Joshua trees and then photographed the book just look at this look at all these gorgeous pages am I going too fast Michael just tell me Michael always tell me just slow down a little bit so I can show the girls everything you have so I just want to browse through some of the pages I don't want to show you all of it because then you don't have any surprises but look at the spread isn't that beautiful just like the one I prepare for you today behind me and I can't wait to go through those quilts and tell you all about them so this book has beautiful beautiful selection of 20 uh, patterns some of my personal favorites a lot of the quilts are made with my linen texture collection and it just gives you an idea of color how you can put it together and some of the quilts are arranged in a rainbow arrangement what is one of the easiest way to arrange your scraps and I have to tell you one of my first 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 quilts a long time ago when I just begin was a rainbow quilt I started with my red blocks I moved on to my oranges yellows greens blues and then shifted to dark and just purples and beautiful beautiful colors it's very easy to organize your scraps that way and I think the rainbow scrap book gives you a really good ideas some of the patterns in the books are existing patterns so you, if you don't want the book you can go ahead and get a pattern and I'm gonna show you just few that I think are just great but if you want an incredible book 20 beautiful patterns this book is for you and what I like about this book it has a variety of skill levels you can be a beginner and find a quilt that works for you then grow your skills and then you're in the media and going to a quilt show and showing off your quilts at the guild or quilt show at the show and tell but then you can really tap into some more difficult quilts and i have one on the table the wild west that are more advanced so i paid attention that i have a variety of skill, uh, skill levels but also variety of sizes if you want a baby quilt you can make it because we have the smaller quilts in the book but if you want a nice big quilt for your uh, table uh, for your bed you can do that as well and trying a block sometimes from some of the quilts that's a good idea and I did that in a book I show you some projects like pillows just made with just a little bit of the blocks to just give you a nice uh, idea what you could do it now let's talk about the quilts that are hanging behind me and then we go over the fabrics again move on to the kids and I hope you're paying attention and writing things down because I'm gonna be asking a lot of cool cool questions for you so just remember there are 20 patterns in the book that you can tap into it and enjoy all your scraps you can copy my colors and just follow the rainbow arrangements with any scraps that you have you could have 
1930 reproduction and your green goes in here your purple goes in here and you get that same feel and look but with your scraps so this is why i made sure that all the uh pictures uh, that are step by steps are colors so you can follow some of that and then make your quilt just with whatever you have in your stash now let's talk about the quilts behind me this first one is the charm basket the finished size of the block is four inches and this quilt is a beautiful showcase of laundry basket uh, fabrics it is just stunning i'm going to be pulling some of the quilts so you can see it a little bit more i'm shifting the colors from blues through yellows down to the reds and just enjoying every bit of fabrics that i designed for endover and i am so so lucky to design fabric for such an amazing company and one of my favorite fabrics that i designed for them is our linen texture fabric linen texture fabric this is this fabric so many times when you wanted to give more hue to the color uh, putting a solid fabric and the linen texture is just the drawings that are on the fabric that look like a linen texture but it's actually just cotton printed fabric there is no linen in it it's just the name of the fabric and the look that I'm trying to mimic that it has like the linen low texture onto it so this bundle is one of my two go bundles linen texture linen tech this is linen texture two and linen texture three is a little bit darker a little bit moodier but oh it is beautiful and matches so nice with other fabrics we have a fat eights we have fat quarters that you can enjoy and what i like to do once i have my fusion of color i call it so good fat eight fat quarter is great then i look at, at my scraps or i go ahead to a bundle like this this one is from seamstress and it's fat eight and look at how nice the fabric match right there so it's easy to do it but if you have scraps this the linen texture will help you have that hue that color that makes that statement did you notice our sweet right look at it i'm gonna put it with our linen texture yes we have those bundles and guess what right after the show the uh sweet right bundles are going on special so if you want some you make sure you go ahead and get some because they match perfectly with our linen texture collection so let's go back to the quilts because i know you're excited about them we started with our charm basket like i told you the blocks are so cute so small four inch finish and there's so many of them another one that i have right here is our be mine and i hope you be mine when you get this book and start making all those beautiful quilts and i would love for you when you're making your quilts hashtag uh, rainbow scraps because that way I get to see all this inspiration all these beautiful quilts that you're making and you inspire back me to get into my scraps and make even more quilts but for example be mine look at this simple heart right here and this one is done again in a rainbow arrangement but if you wanted to you can use the pattern and use just red scraps okay because guess what red is one of the colors on your color wheel and there's nothing wrong with just using one color for your quilt and here if I'm gonna go and use my scraps shading really nice give extra look to my heart like it's three-dimensional and it curves just gently for me so that one calls be mine da 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 with 483 low circle I sprinkle so many beautiful rainbow colors onto this quilt look at this every scraps can go right to it a tiny little circles you can use hand applique machine applique or do what i did just fuse your circles down and enjoy 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 i have another quote that i'm working on it right now from um my uh, hard shape a stencil i'm doing a nice big quilt with all my scraps this one is gonna be fun too that's what's in my sewing basket and that's exactly what the name of this quilt is too sewing basket look at those beautiful half square triangles 
toss and turn with a gorgeous handle base wonderful now you have a beautiful design of a basket but again you can look at it, my quilt crinkle your eyes and say to yourself oh this is such a good idea now all that i have to do is take scraps from my stash that are in green i have some yellow a little bit of brown and i have a beautiful basket you don't have to use the solid colors you could use anything you have and i love mixing solids with printed fabric and I love throwing some batik sometimes into my quilts. So look at this, this beautiful holiday forest is gonna be a celebration of your scraps. Your forest is going to be growing. Just wait, you're going to be get, you get lost in this forest of scraps. You're gonna start with light, go down to dark. You can use prints, you can use solids, put everything together to a beautiful tree design for this gorgeous pattern. And the pattern comes a little bit smaller. I'm showing you my big quilt because guess what? When you start making those trees, you're not gonna be able to stop. You're gonna be making cute little combinations, making trees, and you're gonna end up like me with a much larger quilt. But if you want something smaller, that pattern is a really nice pattern for wall hanging. It's in your book. So right there, look at this this one calls palm springs palm springs and this one is a really nice variety of uh, colors as well going in and out and here up there i have solids and then i put a little print to give a fun little splash of color to it variegated thread did you notice this one one of my best selling patterns one of my best selling ideas i for many many years i have been making variegated threads i have made those with you in another book there was a big applique border this one is very simple very elegant and i wanted to bring this pattern back and i include it in this book because to me this one was truly an perfect inspiration for you guys top and bottoms anchor the craziness and scrappiness of the spools and now notice that you can use any scraps and guess what during our retreat i'm going to be playing with my girls and making some spools and exchanging some strips with them they don't know about it yet but i'm planning i'm planning now look at this compass uh, beautiful quilt this one is made with uh, also rainbow colors from blue shading to green going into red and finishing with black in the middle and also this one is a perfect selection of plaids and wobbins so this is a gorgeous gorgeous quilt and i use the compass collection to make this one oh illuminate he shines those simple so to star look at this beautifully surround a light background star and just glow again in many different colors i don't think there is another pattern that showcases colors as good as trip around the world also known and included in my book as a wildflower quilt this quilt was beautifully made by one of my dear friends debbie and i'm so proud of her and this quilt made the book as well so wildflower is in the book so now you can go ahead if you are hesitating to get the pattern you can now get it through the book and get it with all the other beautiful beautiful patterns that i have another gorgeous quilt right here is our seaweed quilt look how fun and simple just little uh, zigzag going down the quilt and i use the charm pack to create this one so 12 incredible quilts um uh, i mean 11 beautiful quilts sitting behind me just stunning on the table i have all these wonderful goodies and i showed you my linen texture two i shared with you this beautiful linen texture three what are great great bundles to use for this kind of quilts and like i said for any quilts if you want to infuse a little bit extra color use a little bit of a solid give that quilt a little oomph and guess what what i love about um 
this uh, linen texture fabric is that are easy to work with and easy to match with other fabrics that I have. I use a lot of, of the same color dyes so that way everything beautifully matches just like I showed you with our seamstress bundle right here. Look at the seamstress bundle. So let me take the linen texture one more time and show you. Look how nice it mix and matches right there. Um, but we have something brand new. If you wanted something a little bit uh, less color, something more soft and watercolor, we have a brand new collection coming in. In just a few uh, days, we're gonna be putting on our website our next group called Century Solids, Laundry Basket Century Solids. Isn't that lovely? Look at those fabrics. Look at them. They are just beautiful. We have gorgeous shades of red with burgundy and pink look at those then you move on to beautiful yellows and oranges and they shift just perfectly to soft delicate greens and look at the beautiful beautiful blues that you have right there isn't that stunning and then you finish up with those two gorgeous browns that i think just give that nice accent and it's great for branches or anything else if you decide to do applique. What I like about Century Solids, I want to show you this. Look at this. This fabric has a color on wrong and right side of the fabric so you can use it either way it's just gorgeous look at that and the quality is so nice nice and stiff easy to press and enjoy enjoy i know you love the fabric but you want to see them in action and i coincident have it on my table gorgeous quilt that I want to share with you I'm gonna put this to the side and this quilt is our Dallas quilt and I made this quilt with our century solids fabric so look at this look at this oh when I designed this quilt I was so happy with the colors isn't that lovely look how beautiful it is just stunning all these gorgeous colors easy quilting on it just edge to edge and what i did is i used a printed fabric for my background since this was solid i want something more onto the background and i love doing that and i'm planning to do a quite a few quilts with my century solids we have four gorgeous patterns coming out and i love mixing and matching regular fabrics with century solids because it gives me a really fun look to it and a little bit more interesting backgrounds with this one. Our collection called um, Seabreeze is a perfect backgrounds for Century Solid. So if you have not bought Seabreeze yet, you need to get a bundle of that one. Isn't it beautiful? I hope you love it. If not, don't tell me because I'm very sensitive. I don't want to know <coughs> if you don't like something but i know for sure you're gonna love this one this is one of my favorite quilts and guess what this one made the cover isn't that amazing oh uh, erin is smiling so nice to me because guess what she is the genius behind the cover she took that picture and it is a beautiful beautiful isn't it agree with me and notice all the other gorgeous pictures that she have put into my book she has took them they are just stunning it is wonderful to have as somebody like that in the office and be a teammate with it Oh, I'm just so proud. Both Mary and Erin just rocked it. I keep setting up the quilts. The girls took pictures. We went back and forth with it and just tried to give the best to you guys so you have something beautiful. I hope you think uh, and uh, that everything is perfect for you guys and enjoy, enjoy. So when you're looking through the pages stop for a moment and just look at some of the settings that we have how we lined up the quilts how we match things up and just did such a nice job and another person that i want to acknowledge is killeen hardy that put the book together for us she's a graphic designer and she put the book together this book 
we self-publish. So if you would like this book, go to our website, get the book. If you are a store owner, please, please, just call us go to our website get the books to your store so you can share with your customers we would love you to have it and yes the books will be available through checkers through our distributors so if you would like to go through that way that's fine too but if you wanted to we have the books and you can order them right directly from us so right there all right so we have gone through some fun things i think you guys love the quilts yes oh i don't want to miss this quilt i want to show it to you i rolled it here and hid it because it's really cute look at this isn't that sweet i love this quilt and this one is also in a book and i made this nice and small so that way if you want a baby quilt this one is a perfect one for you and guess what i was just looking at this pattern and i cannot wait to use my century solids on the background where the light is and make my circles just white light polka dots and i'm gonna use scraps because i love those scraps maybe something with little drawings on it you know like ch children's drawings so something fun and exciting i would love to have a polka, polka dot quilt but reverse the colors and many times times that's what i want you to do i want you to look at, at the pattern and do your own thing if you wanted to have it in colors in rainbow arrangement you can do that if you want it in red and light you can do that you can reverse you can have the background dark and have the hearts light so it's up to you you are the one i am just inspiring you with the book and hoping that you browse through the pages you suddenly stop at something and said oh i have all this oranges blacks and grays i'm making a wildflower for a halloween go ahead do that now you have everything that you need all the information beautifully put together in a book and another oh this quilt oh, you guys have to see that picture this called fiesta and michael's gonna put a nice big picture for you guys to see it this one is incredible i have this quilt hanging on a wall right here in our studio and i did not want to take it off the wall because i thought I'm gonna save that one that you come and see me at Houston and see the quilt in person it's a deal you come up I will be there you can have your book signed in Houston we enjoy and take a picture in front of that quilt it is beautiful so that's fiesta um, you probably wonder okay now I got the book can I get some kits yes we have some kits that are ready we will be making all the kids from the book we're gonna be celebrating one quilt at a time for 12 days of rainbow scraps so we're gonna be adding a lot of beautiful kids to our website but for now I just want to let you know we do have a be mine and if you don't want a book you just want a pattern we also have this available and many of our customers love to get the book and they browse through the book but they also get pattern and then they write on the pages and so forth so on so that's why we keeping both available and um erin don't let me forget about the special surprise that i have to tell everybody about it that we launched it this afternoon because i almost forgot it okay so and yes guys stay tuned i have a one special surprise for you because i know that a lot of you like to do your own colors and we have something super special that it's coming out with the book as well that i think you'll be interested in it so if you want it you can have a pattern you can have a book another pattern that i know that we have on our website is irish chain this pattern is also available through book and this kit is made with our sweet right collection it's super super cute perfect for little girl or little boy lemoine star is another one made with jelly roll and we have as well the uh, pattern on our website as the kit but also that's this pattern is in our book right now then we have a beautiful seaweed kit and again pattern in a book all available by itself so you can go ahead and get any of those uh, kits grab a book 
if you want it you can grab an extra pattern in case you want to be writing or doing things on that pattern but i can tell you can't wait anymore for that special surprise guess what we also have coming out a beautiful packet of coloring pages with just outlines of all of the quilts from not all of them there's a nice selection i believe there are 12 we, i will check you you will see this tonight um so there's a coloring pages that you can purchase so that way if you get the book and you start designing your own quilt you can have a coloring pages to color on it to you know do your own thing and kind of uh get an idea how things gonna look for you so we have a coloring pages coming out that are complement to our book with the uh, quilts from the book now another thing that i want to bring to your attention we do have acrylic template for one of the patterns that it's in a book called teller shop and this one the acrylic uh templates are just wonderful to cut that uh quilt and cut the blocks for that quilt just so easy so easy so if you want to you can go to our website now you got all these awesome ideas but there's always something that you wanted just a little bit more guess what one of our free patterns that you can download on our website picture of the quilt not the pattern the pattern is free on our website so you can go to our website download the pattern but you can go ahead and see beautiful picture of this quilt let me find it for you and you can enjoy it as well so we do have one quilt right there see this one right there he made the book just as a little accent but it takes you to our website so that way you can get a, a free pattern if you would like i'm browsing through the pages browsing through the pages i'm still not familiar exactly where everything is because we just got this book but oh it was really close by i must have lost it i think that's that's the picture that i'm thinking about it so right there this calls wildflower i have it up there for you oh thank you michael but the girls are probably want as girls and guys want to also see the quilt in uh just as i'm holding so look at this this is another perfect idea of arranging your scraps from yellow to red to blues just enjoy enjoy so that one is available as well uh if you wanted to now if you have now book you have all the beautiful kits you got a bundles and like i said there will be some bundles for sale this afternoon so make sure you join us in so there are two things that are coming out this afternoon coloring pages and a bundle so make sure you uh you paying attention and um checking it out it's gonna be the sweet ride bundle that is gonna go on special erin is shaking her head and saying yeah we got it girl because i know the girls were getting ready to put that on for sale for you guys and that would be a really nice bundle to mix with our linen texture and make some really nice colorful quilts but if you have all those things you're probably looking for some new special tools and guess what we have something super special i am just thrilled that we get to sell on our website those beautiful incredible tools made by a company called modern american and um, they are just so nice oh the tools are just beautiful i have been a fan for quite a while and now we're gonna have some of those for sale we have a limited amount of them so if you want it just go ahead grab your set and we sell them by a set they're on our website right now so if you want it there's a little seam ripper i hope you never have to use it there's a little bit a pointer you little stiletto so it's easy if you have to turn things inside out and a little hand pressing tool i really like those we also have your favorite this is one of our tools made by laundry basket quilts so delicate so cute this is my personal favorite we are getting more of those we're gonna restock this afternoon i just got a note from our guide that makes them that are uh, that he has just finished some more of those and we have two new tools made 
for us by Laundry Basket Quilts made here in USA. Two clappers. Those, when you're pressing your seams and you want to set your seam down, you put this right down and you press it. And we have two of them. One has a round top and a square bottom just in case you have that block that you wanted to make sure that it, you want to lay it all the way and then we have one that is the traditional round and run and what we did we designed one that the top is bigger and the bottom is a little bit smaller so it's super easy to hold and work with it so if you want it we just got those those are brand new i'm actually gonna grab those too and of course i'm grabbing this cute set for me for home because those are just beautiful every single one is a little bit different because they're handmade and they're just incredible so thank you thank you uh, guys for visiting our website and getting those i'm super proud we get to carry this beautiful beautiful items so those are the few things now you have been waiting and you're ready for your contest before we go to the contest i want to remind you about our incredible kitchen towels and i want to thank you thank you thank you for giving us so much love for our kitchen towels you guys are just so good to us we have the beautiful original designs we have christmas designs so if you're looking for nice gifts for holidays and it's never too early to start shopping look at this i would have get one of those maybe one of those and i have a little ribbon onto it maybe a little orofil thread with it and my friend that has everything could use something new and exciting and of course guess what getting a book for someone as a gift throwing a little towel with it and now you have a beautiful set or oh, if you feel generous adding few tools to it treat yourself you need to get this gift for yourself right now go to our website and just get it for yourself because guess what i'm getting this for me i it's today i need it you know some of those days you don't want to wait for somebody to get things for you you treat yourself nice so this is a really nice one but guess what i'm gonna treat you nice guys today 12 of you will 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 win our brand new book and please, please, when you get the book, please post on your Instagram and tell your friends about it. I really need your help to spread good word about it. What a wonderful book it is. We have worked so hard on it. Do you know that it took us one year to bring this book to life? It was so much work, so much editing. And I think once you browse through those pages, you recognize the look of laundry basket quilts and this beautiful, beautiful designs. And I hope you're gonna treasure that one for a long time. If you need a copy that it's signed, just let us know. I'm here, I'm gonna be a little bit busy with my retreaters, but never too busy for you guys to sign your book. And I'm so thankful if you're getting a copy. But now let's get into contest. I have my questions. I have them set on a side so you guys cannot see it. I wrote some questions down so we don't have to pull it last minute ideas. So, um, oh, this is the first question. Can you tell me how many patterns we have in our beautiful new book? How many patterns? is in our new book rainbow scraps anybody i love it i think some of the ladies already thought that you were asking a question because they were answering stuff and we haven't even asked it yet <laughs> i love that so I love that. guys we, you're playing alone and we didn't even ask the question yet yep but we do have and i think i think today you wanted me to do random random perfect yes erin is in charge of picking random names i'm gonna be asking questions and we're gonna move on through the quilts and erin can i ask you a favorite as Absolutely. we're waiting for the uh answers ask me a question and i'm you gonna be it. answering them perfect. so we move the show really nice we do have our first winner yes. of the rainbow scraps book and it is uh the answer is 20 there's 20 patterns in there and our uh winner is loretta kretzer Loretta, congratulations. Please remember, email us your address. So everybody that wins, please remember, email us your address so that way we can ship the book to you 
and yes you just want a brand new copy of our brand new book and guess what they are just so cool and guess what don't be sad if you do not win the book you can just go ahead to our website and order the book and we will ship it to you too so we have plenty of copies for everybody i'm so super excited about this book all right next questions for you guys guys is um oh how many colors are in a rainbow does anybody know how many colors are in their rainbow come on I you can it. tell me such an appropriate question and while we're waiting for some answers to come in yes um i do have a question that we've gotten from quite a few people about the blue star quilt and scrappy star I love will that. alaska ruler work with that or do they need something else because of the size uh no so for this one alaska ruler would not work for this one this one uses 60 degree ruler so you can go ahead and get the ruler we also have templates on our website so you can go ahead the templates and we have a brand new template ruler i call it it's a ruler that has all the templates on it that is going to come out next week too but basic 60 degree ruler would work great for you uh go ahead grab one of those i'm going to pull the quilt so i can show you that quilt one more time without making a big old mess and covering my cute question did anybody answer how many um Colors is in color wheel? Yes, we sure do. Wonderful. Elaine Hamilton is our winner, and the answer is seven. Yes, that's correct. Congratulations, Elaine. You just won a beautiful book called Rainbow Scraps. And please email us your address so we can ship it to you. All right, guys. Next question How many houses are in a teller shop pattern? how many house blocks are in a teller shop pattern now you go ahead start thinking about it browse through pictures try to figure it out and did you notice i did not show you that quilt <laughs> i did not show you that quilt because i knew i'm gonna be asking you this question do you love this one i just love this one it's so beautiful but the blue one stunning just wait you see pictures i'm gonna once i quilt i cannot wait to take a picture on my bed and i just got new pillow shames it's gonna be really really pretty so um i'm gonna pull that one to show you again anybody answer the question we, we do we have a winner um, and the winner is Pat Morris, and the answer is nine houses. Yes, we have nine houses in our teller shop uh, pattern. This one was one of the last quilts in the book. It's right in the back, and I loved it. And by the way, I loved, loved the pictures and the sunsets and the settings. It was so easy to just to be there and enjoy it one of the i want to show you want to show you wait you do yeah. so it's one of the last one right there perfect nine so another question that i have for you guys is what is the uh subtitle for our book what is the subtitle for our book we know that it's rainbow scraps but what is the subtitle i'm hiding the book because i don't <laughs> want you to be cheating and in the meantime i'm gonna show you the blue star again do we have any other questions yes Erin? donna uh, excuse me so yarnum is wondering question on patterns and books um in the book do any of them have y seams she is a beginner uh yes one of the quilts have y seams uh the other eight point star it does not have y seams so that way remember i told you you have a more beginner and then more advanced quilters can enjoy this book so one of the y seam pattern is our fiesta pattern right here but the directions are so nice so clear big pieces you pin it i'm telling you you can do it and this quilt is done with just one fat eight bundle from our linen texture too it's super cool and what i did is again I add just uh, three pieces that are printed fabric just to give a little color onto it 
quilting shows incredible on it come to houston see me in my booth so you can get a close-up look on that quilt and visit with me for a few minutes and notice the eight point star the lemoyne star that it's right next to it do you see it's also eight point star that one no y seams it's made in a just regular way with uh, triangles and this is how you make the block and then put it together to a, a beautiful beautiful quilt let me show you the quilt one more time it's right here isn't that lovely so you have variety what is really nice you have some y seams and there are none um also the cover quilt wild west no y seams so just 45 degree diamonds and i broke that quilt to section the pattern is so good you need to make one of those quilts it's one of a kind okay do we have any other questions we have a winner oh we do fantastic um okay. our winner for that question about the subtitle of the yes. book is susan bell and um color wheel quilts is the that's answer. correct susan you are right thank you so much for answering and you just won yourself a beautiful beautiful book and yes it calls rainbow scraps color wheel quilts because when i think of a rainbow quilts a color wheel is the uh, tool that I would use to organize all my scraps so I hope you do it too and we do have two different color wheel on our website we have a little one and a big one so maybe you want to grab a color wheel with your rainbow scraps book today now another questions that question that I have for you is guys how many quilts are hanging behind me how many quilts are hanging behind me we have the baskets we have this we have that there's so many beautiful beautiful quilts oh variegated thread how many quilts are behind me any other questions for me Erin yes we do um let's see here we had one from Casey Shaw and she was wondering what is the basket quilt um uh, hanging behind you and is it all one? linen texture fabric yes in this one you have all linen texture it calls sewing basket and it's not a big quilt it's a smaller quilt and notice one two three four five baskets by six baskets so only 30 baskets to make but if you want it you can really enjoy and make this bigger and bigger and you know recently I've been looking at my scraps and I'm like I have to do this again my next one I'm gonna use a variety of scraps and I'm gonna mix some printed with some solids so I think that's gonna be just wonderful if you guys want it we could do it together some sewing baskets I think uh, that would want that would be so much fun and I toss and turn the baskets around the quilt so that way uh, the handles are go in many different directions so it's not the traditional way I really really like this one so sewing basket yes it's in a book and the handle I just fused it and did a little zigzag around the edges with wonderful thread really really nice one so uh did anybody answer our questions yes. how many quilts absolutely yeah? we've got a Who ton of answers winner? and our winner today is Gigi odom and the answer is 11. congratulations Gigi, and thank you so much for joining mm -hmm. our show and playing along you just want a beautiful book called rainbow scraps and i hope hope you enjoy all the beautiful quilts in it and yes uh, we have 11 quilts hanging behind me. Don't forget to send your address so we can ship the book to you, please. So next question for you guys is, what quilt made the cover? What is the name of the quilt that is on the cover? And yes, I did show you that quilt. I'm gonna do it one more time because I know you love this quilt. So what is the name of this beautiful quilt that it's on my cover? And Erin, do we have any questions for me? Um, you know what? We actually do. Oh, oh girls and guys yeah. are just playing. They're excited about answering. They're not asking questions today. Everybody's just like, I want this book and I want to win it. Um, I, I know I'm excited about this book too. And I'm happy for you guys you winning it so did anybody answer uh, yes we right. definitely have an answer and we actually just had a, a 
customer question come through, oh, awesome. which I love. And I just would love to take this opportunity. If you do have any problems asking a question via the chat throughout the week, if you think of anything, feel free to email customer service at support. We would love to bring that to um, the show and we can gladly answer that stuff for you or via email as well. So I love that. Yeah. Yes. And guess what, guys? Anytime you want me to show you something, many sometimes you're like, how did you do this binding? Oh, how do I make an eight point star? You know, can you show that Y seam one more time? I'm your girl to do this. So just send us that question, send us your request. Maybe I'm not gonna do it right away, but I promise you, if you ask, eventually I will do it. I'm pretty good with it. Perfect. So please always feel free to reach out to our customer service and our girls are the best at our customer service. And we do have an answer to what the cover quilt is. Yes. And our winner is Lisa Shepleck. And the answer is Wild West. Fantastic, Lisa. Congratulations. You just won a book. And please make sure you email us your address. And thank you so much for playing along and watching. And next question is, oh, wow. Are you guys going to love this one? And guess what? With this question, whoever answer, you're going to get the book and get a little bundle from me. What are the fabric that I have been talking about? What is the fabric collection that I use in a lot of the quilts to infuse some extra color to it? What is the name of that collection? Great question. And mm -hmm. while we're waiting, we did have a customer reach out to customer service yes. with a question. And that question is, uh, they'd like to know the name, if possible, for machine quilting that you had done on Palm Springs. They oh. are loving how that shows on Do screen. Do you love that? So this is just a simple braid, simple braid. And I love it so much because you can use it as a border, but many times I use it as an edge to edge. It is so nice. It has a traditional favorite with like a modern clean look to it, you know, and I, I just love the waves. So this one calls just, it's a simple braid. I, it came with my machine, so and I use it quite often. Guess what? Yesterday I was quilting some of the mini quilts that we're working for our little quilts club, and I used that on one of the quilts. And I just did it. It's tiny. It's 12 inch by 12 inch, and I just did a five rows of the braids. It's so cute. So so cute. Awesome. Okay. Did we Thank have you. an answer? We sure do. We okay. have a winner, and our winner is J. Uh, excuse me, it is Paulette Miller. Paulette, congratulations. Linen and guess textures. what? With your book, I'm going to include a little bit of fabric from that linen texture collection because I know you would enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. So we have Fed Quarters, Fed Aids, Half Yard. Go to our website. We have a lot of beautiful linen texture fabric, but that's the a uh, little secret, little magic. When I want my quilts to have a lot of nice color, when I have scraps and they look super busy, what I do is I infuse a little bit of solid fabric to it to anchor some of the scrappiness and give a little extra oomph to it. So that's the little secret right there. Now, another question that I have for you guys, um, I talked to you about the pattern that it's a free pattern on our website. What is the name of the quilt that made the book, but the pattern is free on our website? So please tell me. I talked to you about that. I showed you that quilt. Great and question. we have this quilt in many different colors. So that's why I included it in the book because I wanted you to connect the website with all our resources there, all the free patterns, but also have the eye candy, how beautifully those quilts display in a home setting. And we had such a wonderful time photographing the book and, and had such a beautiful setting. So. Oh, I think you would really enjoy seeing it. So do we know? I think this one's yes. actually going to be a little bit more difficult for everyone. Oh, so I see. So let's hang tight for a minute, but I do have a question I from a customer. I love that, please. How do you recommend hanging quilts? So there are all different ways uh, that you can uh, do it. There, my One of my personal favorite, it's a nice ladder. If you can get a ladder, and I'm going to bring something to show you guys. And... Um, 
we usually have them covered so you don't see them. But this is the ladders that we have it in our studio. If you are interested in those, let us know and we can see if we can make them for you guys and sell them so that way you could enjoy it. But I sometimes go to antique show or go to garage sale and I get an old ladder and those are the ones that I have it in my house with a little paint on it. Oh, it looks so gorgeous to have a quilt on that. So that's my favorite way to hang quilts. And in fact, for our new studio that we're gonna be moving in in January, I'm right now collecting a bunch of old, junky, beautiful, incredible ladders because we're gonna have a whole wall of them and bunch of quilts on it. And you guys have to come to our showroom in California to see this beautiful, beautiful display that I'm getting ready and our beautiful showroom, our beautiful classroom. I'm excited about that. So uh, ladders are a nice way, hangers and the small quilts. I just use pins and I just push it into the sheet rack. Michael is not always happy about it, but guess what? When I pull the pin, I can just rub it with a, a, my nail all, take this and rub it back and forth and the hole just blends away so that's the easiest way for me michael is like please don't pin quilts to my walls guess what i live in that house too <laughs> it's my wall too i think you just okay. gave away your secret <laughs> yes yes now he knows how i hang that quilt michael is right there behind the camera he's enjoying the show just as much as you guys do we, did we have an answer we for do awesome. someone finally got it and that winner um with the correct answer is katie christensen and it was flower wall yes katie congratulations you're gonna get a book from me thank you so much for playing along i'm so happy make sure you send us your address so that we can ship your book to you and yes the name was flower wall another question for you guys is what is the newest collection of solid fabrics that are coming out to laundry basket quilts yes i did i showed you this collection today it's brand new we're gonna have it on our website maybe even we start putting up some today but definitely next week we're already gonna have some yardage so i'm super excited for you guys perfect and we do have it online so you can sign up to get notified once it's available wonderful why don't you guys do that please you can just go uh, click on sign up and then when the fabric is being available you get an email and then you have a first choice so you don't have to email us and say it's sold out before i even get there you can be the first one to get it perfect and i'm a uh, question for yes. you editor from I me that is now our answer that we're looking for is it going to be the actual title of the uh fabric collection from andover or a generic, generic. answer generic Let's okay make perfect generic. so then we've got a winner yes. it is janice geist century solid perfect yes it's century solids and janice you just want a book uh, Century Solids, it's a bright name for the collection because there are multiple pieces. There are Century Solids that Endover does, but I have exclusive collection with just my color. So Laundry Basket Century Solids is my bundle. So uh, those are the colors that I chose and matched it up to the fabrics that I designed that will go really nice with anything else that I do. And all that you notice that I went a one shade lighter because I want it to be a little bit more uh, watercolor feel to it. I have some big plans for it so I'm super excited about it. Yeah. All right so another wonderful question I have for you guys and maybe you just have to throw a guess out there. Can you tell me how many circles I have in this beautiful da 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 quilt? So start guessing how many circles I have in this beautiful da 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 quilt. I hope somebody is gonna tell me. Come on guys, I'm super excited for you. And um, so I think we might have a little, oh, you know what? Already? Somebody got it right, first answer. So we're gonna go ahead and give it to Heidi Rogers. Heidi? At how many? 
483. Congratulations. Wow. Heidi, I can't believe it how fast you did this. She was this. paying attention. Wow, I love that. See, I told you guys during the show, I mentioned something. So make sure you always write it down, watch the whole show and enjoy it. And can I ask you a favorite, guys? You having so much fun. Please make sure you give us thumbs up, share this video with your friends and tell them about it so more guys and girls can come and watch the show with us because the more the mirror and we're going to have so many more fun shows where we can win some prizes and enjoy each other's company and learn things. So we have not done for a little bit like a jump into sewing video where you guys come and I show you something new. So if you have any requests, I'm prepping things for next week Friday and uh, I would love 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 to be able to do some sewing with you guys Erin is uh, pointing to me because next week Friday we also have our retreaters coming up so more about our live show during the week pay attention we still would love to have a live show but with our retreat coming uh, retreaters coming in there may be some uh, changes so pay attention to it and I always wanted to see you guys now another question that i have for you what is the size on the basket on our first quilt right here charm basket what is the finish size for this cute little basket block do you remember i told you about it and somebody's gonna get a beautiful copy of our book rainbow scraps uh, color wheel quilts with beautiful 20 quilts in it if the answer co correctly what is the finished size of the basket do we already have an answer we do they are flying wow in. guys you are incredible so we'll go ahead and pick another yes. random winner and it is chris quar four inch congratulations chris you just won a beautiful book we're gonna ship it to you and I am so, so excited. I hope you make some of those baskets too. I am just so happy for you guys. All right, we're moving along. This is our last question for today is, oh, oh, this is a great one. Do you guys gonna love this? How many quilts we have on a back cover? How many pictures of quilts? we have on a back cover on our book how many pictures of quilts we have on a back cover of our book do you know you can guess it you can guess it if you don't know if you don't have the book or can go and see uh, the uh, back of the book so just guess it you know maybe you are lucky today you know what i'm gonna go with our first answer we already have an answer yes that's it, fantastic um it is susan gideon and the answer is 11. susan congratulations i can't believe it you knew it right away yes we have 11 beautiful pictures and there was a picture of me as well so uh 11 quilts on a back cover i hope you enjoy 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 do we have any other questions from our customers that was it for today i love that guys you made my day thank you so much for coming in and celebrating our rainbow scraps books with me Please, please make sure you post pictures, tell your friends about it, spread a good word, what a beautiful book it is, because we would love to quilt with you and we'd love everyone enjoy this book as much as we did enjoy making it. And I think I'm speaking up from the whole team because it takes a team to make a book. And thank you so much for coming today and watching our show. Happy quilting.